think his name is Mark Wahlberg, though. He kept calling him Marky Mark. That's what his, I'm his friend, so that's what his friends get to call oh, him. Oh, you guys are cool. Yeah, we get to, I, his friends get to call him Marky Mark. Welcome back, all of you movie lovers, you film buffs, you breadheads. It's another review, another breadsticks take, and today is a very special one because we are doing a requested review, right? Our boy Strong, he says, hey, can you watch Uncharted? Can you tell me what you think? So, I'm going to. I'm going to do it right now. Uncharted, starring Tom Holland, right, and Marky Mark. What's it about? It's kind of a globe-trotting adventure movie based off of a franchise of video games launched by Naughty Dog. The whole premise of the movie is there's 500 billion in, in, in sunken gold. It's Ferdinand Magellan's gold, right? It's hidden somewhere and they need some keys and they're gonna track it down and they're gonna get that gold, split it up. I mean, that's the whole point of a treasure hunter movie, right? Is to actually hunt the treasure and get it and be rich, which I mean, I wish me and Kenny G could hunt some treasure and get rich. That's not like a good time, but we're not here to talk about me and Kenny G's treasure hunting. We're here to talk about Uncharted. It, it's got some great people in it. Like I mentioned, Tom Holland, Marky Mark. It's got Antonio Banderas, who I love. I've loved him since Desperado. Uh, he plays the, the bad guy, Mankato, in this, okay? And uh, it's a good flick. It's definitely kind of in the vein of like an Indiana Jones or a National Treasure with Nick Cage. Very much kind of a puzzle solving, travel around the world, getting clues and figuring out what's going on, kind of freewheeling high adventure movie and I loved it. Now I'm going to be honest with you, sometimes when you have a movie based off of a video game franchise, the fans are disappointed. I know, I've been through it, it happens and I really thought maybe this would be one of those times. I watched the movie and I loved it but I've never played the games. I don't know anything about the games, i would never even heard of the games until this came out. But from everything I've read and from everything I've seen, it seems like the fans are pretty happy about it. Pretty happy with the way the movie came out. Felt like it really kind of brought the game to life and brought the characters to life. Tom Holland plays Nathan Drake. Marky Mark plays Victor Sullivan or Sully. And it seems like the fans are happy with the way it shook out. And I can see why. It's a fun, loving movie. Now, it's never going to replace Indiana Jones, okay? It's never gonna be a classic, in my opinion. But it's a good, solid, fun watch. I would definitely recommend it. Even if you have never played the video games, like me. If you've never played the video games, but you love those kind of adventure movies, it's definitely worth a watch. Delivers a few unique thrills. I liked it. Tom Holland really delivers on Nathan Drake's character. And same with Marky Mark. Same with Mark Wahlberg with Sully. Just really delivers on it. If you got some time to kill on a Saturday afternoon, turn on Uncharted, stream it, you can find it. And now the time you've all been waiting for, the rating. The bread stick rating. I think I'm gonna give it a 3.9 bread stick rating. Good watch, ton of fun, great cast. Love the movie. Love the fact it's based off a video game series and kind of brought that to life for a lot of fans. I know I always love that when that happens. When you're really invested in a video game franchise and they make a movie and the movie delivers, that's always a cool feeling. And you forever kind of picture those characters as the actors from then on out. So 3.9 breadsticks. I loved it. I think you'll love it. And that was Breadsticks Take on Uncharted. <laughs>